With the recent increase of people working in data science and machine learning, it has become increasingly competitive. And so, one has to do more to stand out from the crowd. Well, one thing that one can do, well, one thing you can do is to get certified. But then there are also so many certifications around. Which one should I go for? Well, Google Cloud has launched one new certificate called the Google Cloud Machine Learning Engineer Certificate. And it's hella difficult to get. But once you do get it, it will really make you stand out. So this certification is relatively new, it's like six to five or four months old and it tests you on your capabilities not only on machine learning code and machine learning modeling but also on cloud infrastructure, on architecture, on strategy, decision making, machine learning code of course but also optimization costs etc etc. So it's an all round certification, more than just coding, it shows that you can really manage things, you can think long term, strategize which really makes you stand out from the crowd. Out. Now, to pass this exam, you need two hours where there are 120 questions with one minute each, so you have two hours to pass the whole exam. Since it's randomly assorted, maybe you can get easy questions in the, in the end and the difficult questions in the beginning. So don't lose hope if you find yourself confronted with many, many, many difficult questions. You can, you can always come back to them afterwards and check them before you submit the final exam. Since some of the questions are very easy, so you can win a lot of time doing that. For this certificate, there is no financial aid, sadly. However, there are many ways for you to prepare before taking the exam. So one of the things is there are, the, uh, there are some sample questions that you can uh, revise there are also webinars and seminars with people who already got the exam you can ask them they will not be able to give you the exact questions because it's NDA protected however you can still uh, have a general a good idea of what is going to be on the exam now one thing to I want to say about the content now you will find a guide with all the things that you may need to revise however I would give you something else as an insider who got the exam uh, it's more likely uh, categorized into four different types of questions one would be your knowledge of basic machine learning modeling with TensorFlow, of course but also the second place would be your knowledge of Google Cloud APIs so it's, since it's a Google Cloud certification so you need to know your, uh, your, your APIs like the Compute Engine, like the, uh, the, um, the uh, Kubernetes Engine, like the VMs, like the machine learning, like the AI services anything that is uh, machine learning API based so you have to revise that then you will be asked about architecture, about orchestration, about flow, about costs, about how to set up a project in advance and finally decision making and strategy, how should you deploy things, how should you sample our data from real life use cases as if you are a manager, it's not technical, it's a manager point of view. So you can revise the first three yourself, the last one will come from experience, it already says that you need some years of experience but you can get that if you work a lot with accelerators, startups uh, or if you are a consultant you can get that really fast. However, I do advise you to take some time before taking this exam, it's not that easy. If if you ask any, any, any of the people who that did get it, it's not easy, it's really hard to get. But once you do, you will stand out from the rest. Your name will appear in the Google Cloud Certified Community, which are already not that many. And you will be able to hopefully get better offers than you have right now. So with this, I do hope that I answered some of your questions. I will put links in the, uh, in the description and I hope that you get the certification. See you soon.